Hey guys, I'm back, and this is a ready review for Transformers Prime, Step Reverse, Fallback, and so this is actually a little update to this. I actually didn't get this Saturday, so this does um, I have another addition to my Transformers Prime collection. So I mean, I went to Target and um, one was like, "Oh, let's get McDonald's for lunch." I'm like, "Nah, let's get." A so I found this for only five bucks, actually cheaper than Walmart because I think they're like six or seven bucks at Walmart, and they got this guy thirty for only five. So, and the Commanders were only eight bucks instead of ten or eleven. So, uh, anyway, this is Fallback and uh, it's Series Two on uh, thirteen, well, Series Two thirteen. They do have his card. I have everything here except for the instructions with the same box in the menu. So take a look at his packaging so we get a look at him to put it aside. For now, take a look at this. Quagma uh, wave blaster, which is this thing. So if you seen the show, see the weird triangle. Weapon or whatever that what you see. So, um, tech specialist. I'm not sure what breakdown was because I mean this is a repaint, but I'm not sure what breakdown was. I think it was like heavy munitions or something. So, yeah. Series two out of thirteen. Technical data is strength is six, which for the size of a uh, character in the show, you expect them to be a whole lot. Stronger. Intelligence 9, uh, speed 4, which I can kind of see with a big SUV like this. Endurance 8, uh, rank 7, courage 5, that kind of believe. Uh, Fire Blast 8, and skill 9. So, and there's a nice little picture of one too about alliance. So. Inside. Here's his card. Fallback tech specialist. I'll read the thing in a minute. But there he is in his robot mode and his uh, technical truck mode. It more looks like an off road SUV. But I'm going to read the bio. Uh, it says, Before the war, Fallback scouted newly discovered worlds to determine if they were suitable for colonization. Now his duty is to assess a world environmental health and recommend ways in which the Autobots can protect it while also using natural resources to their advantage. And of course at the bottom, like every Cyberverse figure, command your world, Autobots on one side, Decepticons on the other. The thing on the commander class, they show you the um, play such like the Star Hammer and the Driller. Anyway, here he is. I don't have the uh, Generation 1 Outback, which is a home homage to. So, I mean, it's the exact same colors as the Generation 1 Comfort. Let's take a look at his gun, quick, which is translucent green. Um, got a hole which you can plug in. Any other sort of reverse weapon? So, yeah. Anyways, then this guy. Um, got silver for the bumper and grill. Got black for his windows. Uh, silver tire, some brown or red on top. Um, gray for the tires. How much robot? Cable stuff basically at the bottom. But you see it right there. So. Anyway, tank strong. What I do is turn the front, separate the front part, fold it all the way back. Put on his legs. I like that. And keep. You want to put that way, put it down. 
the very way that we had. And you can pull these on, pull one of them down. And then pull it on, press it down, push it up, separate his legs, and there you got set reverse leaving parts. Ball back. Get him this thing real quick. Pretty nice. Decent sized picture. At first, what I thought of this guy and the breakdown version, I thought this was going to be a commander class, but I guess I was wrong. So, yeah. Didn't get it. Can we get one real quick? Can we get Sky Quick? I'm not going to take too long. But, anyway, he's a nice figure. Um, Still got that brownish and brown reddish rust color to them. Still got the pan and the silvers some spots, especially down inside the body. Show you the head and the Autobot logo in a second. There's the Autobot logo right in his chest. There's his head, which is silver, and I think it has blue eyes. And the blue eyes. See that? There you go. Yeah, I kind of see the blue eyes. Precise comparison. Here's the next few. Uh, Sky But you can't wait for the Voyager. Actually, there you go. Well, yeah, this guy, this guy's taller and wider. Uh, this one's not as much bulky because of the wing. If he's uh, back tail or back bend or whatever weren't there, this guy might have been uh, skinnier. Exactly. Uh, but yeah, this has been the review of. Transformers Prime, Cyber Reverse, Fallback, um, please comment, rate, subscribe, do all that stuff. Thumbs up, no thumbs down. Um, I guess I might never know your view tonight. Because it's only 6.30 and it's dark as holy crap. So, see you later. Most likely, in a while, maybe an hour. I don't know why. I'm still looking for the next review. So, see ya.